Gibby DIY. I'm going to show you how to solve the three by three. Uh, before we get started, though, uh, get you a good cube, uh, a magnet cube, a speed cube. Uh, don't waste your time with the uh, the generics. Um, they look good. I, I'm going to say the generic, the, the original Rubik's. I bought them because of their original colors. But these things are they're sticky to hang up and you and you will uh, sometimes that pop out but anyway go with a speed cube and uh, you can't go wrong you won't be wasting your money they slide so good you know what I'm talking about if you use one and also remember start with a three by three learn a three by three first and after that, all they all spin off the three by three with a few little variations, and uh, we will show you that. So anyway, let's get started with the three by three. The first thing we're going to do is mix this cube up. Here we go. And once you know it's done mixing it up yourself, you have somebody else to mix it up for you. There we go. Okay, now we're going to mix it up real good. No rhyme or reason. Just mix it up. All right, good enough. All right, the very first thing you're gonna do on the three plate three by three is solve the white cross. So this is the main part, and I always solve for white first. So you can solve any color you want to, but most cubers do white side up. But that's just what we do. Okay, so here's a white. So now I need another white right here, and that's the white is over here on the green. So see this white and green? Go and turn it up, white and green here. Okay, so what goes here is the white and red. So I'm going to spin this around this way, come back around this way, and back up. So doesn't matter how you do it. This is kind of redundant. I just fly through this stuff because I've been trying to work through these cubes for so long. When I couldn't get them, I always could get one side. So that is the goal. We're going to get this whole first layer here. That is the goal. So we need to do that by getting across. So there's a white orange there. See, I brought them back in. Still everything here. So I need a uh, white blue one here. Here it is around here. So, so I got my cross. See how this, this, this. And this is the same. Now let's get the edge. Now we'll do the corner pieces. This one's already in. Here's one right here. It needs to be flipped around. So we'll, we'll do the right, right prime, down prime, right regular D, right prime, down prime, right. See that made it. So, all right, so now we're going in here to this next one here. Here's a white, red, a white, orange, and green. So I know it goes here, so I'm just going to bring it over here. Slide it and see how I got my hands here. Holding it in place. Slide this down. Back up. See how I did that? Here's this piece. So we can do that. Right prime. Down prime. Right down right prime down prime right and it made it so that is the first layer the, the white whole layer we flip it upside down now we're ready to get the second layer and the second layer since we've already got the middle is these little side pieces so what we're going to do we're going to look for a piece that doesn't have the yellow in it because the yellow is always at the top. So here's a green and red piece. So what I'm going to do is slide it over here until I line it up with these red piece. And I know it goes on this side. So that is a right side, a right sided algorithm. And you will need to know this because it's going to help you on every cube you ever decide to solve it. It's really important. So, to put this piece over here, it goes like this. It goes up, right, 
and it goes e prime right prime u prime f prime u and f see how it went there isn't that awesome so let's look for another one piece here's a green orange so we slide it over here here's the green and orange this time it's going over here on the left side so you will use this left algorithm which is u prime l prime u l u f u prime f prime see how it went in and you just keep doing this here's another piece it goes right here no I'm sorry it goes up here on the left side see same thing so to do the left side again it's u prime l prime u and then it goes um l u front u prime front prime let's see so remember primes are counterclockwise the one without the uh dash is, is uh clockwise it's that simple see we're getting there so we're looking around we need one more piece here here it is so sometimes one of your pieces is down here don't need to be so you've got to use one of these and just knock it out uh, get it in there um, so for example this piece goes here so that is in a left sided algorithm again so u prime left prime u l u f u prime f prime okay so now i got the whole second layer done see and uh, now we're ready to get the cross on the top so what i like to do is uh look for an l this is this l right here so you put the l just like this in this position when you do that you do this algorithm and is to uh, get your cross at the top so what it's going to do is it's going to be uh, front prime up prime l prime then it's u l f see how i got the cross that's what you want so now at that's at this point we we're ready to solve these sides on your cross so what you're going to do is you're going to spin it around try to find two sides there'll be two sides that will match and that it is here on the three by three so you got here and here see these two don't match so in other words i got the blue yellow green when you see that you will turn it this way towards you it'll be to the right and then in the back the right and back and then when you do that to uh this algorithm you will do you would do the uh you would hold it here and you would do right u right prime u right up twice right prime u see how it's solved that's good all right now we're ready uh to put the corners in the right place all right so what we're going to do we're going to look around here there's usually going to be one side that's going to be right or it could be none or it could be all of them in the right place uh, so in this case we've got one in the right place here so what i'm going to do is going to put the the one that's right on the right side right here on the corner here and we're going to do this algorithm and what it's going to do basically is going to keep this one steady and it's going to rotate these three around until they get in the right spot okay so this algorithm is up right 
up prime, left prime, up, right prime, up prime, and left. Okay, let's look here. And this one's right now. And I know all these rest of them, these are going to be right, but we'll look anyway. So uh, sometimes you have to do that more than once. So that's the algorithm you use to orientate the corners in the right place. All right, we're ready to move to the last part to solve this cube. Now, we're ready for the last step, and I call it the death row. When you see, if you're competing against somebody in a race and you see them do this move, it's, uh, I call it the death row. So what you're gonna do is always work right here on this corner. And you'll see what I'm talking about. So in this, you're gonna be a right prime. You're gonna be a down prime. You're gonna be a right prime. And you're gonna be down. So right prime, down, prime, right, down, right, prime, down, prime, right, down, right, prime, down, right. You see how that did that? And then once you get there, don't forget to turn your bottom piece this way. And then you turn this piece you're trying to work with right here. Keep and continue it again. Right, prime, down, prime, right, down, right, prime, down, prime, right, down, right, prime, down prime right down right prime down prime right see how it's soft and then don't forget to turn this piece here and then you turn this one here this is the one you're trying to solve so at this point it looks like the cube's messed up right so now right prime down prime right down right prime down prime right and it's solved don't forget to turn this piece we're looking for one more piece here, and we have solved the three by three. Right prime, down prime, right, down, right prime, down prime, right, bam, bam. Hallelujah, thank you, Lord. And you solved the three by three. Isn't that neat? Even an old redneck can do it, guys. Remember. Keep Christ in your life, folks. He's the only way to go. Gotta have him. And look at my other videos. I'm going to show you how to solve all these other cubes. Yeah. Thank you and God bless.